Hey, what's up? Of course, it is Lita of My Natural Me. Week isn't useless. And it is mental health awareness. And let me just say, I love talking about this topic. So I stopped in to my favorite <laughs> healthy cafe, Vibe the Healthy Spot. I'm here with Mishi, the owner, who has an amazing story, right? About just transforming your health and improving your mental health. You see, I'm drinking this amazing healthy drink. So She's I'm actually, like, yes. <laughs> I'm gonna let you talk okay. because you have just such an amazing story as to why you opened up this shop and how the physical health really connected with the mental health. So Mishi, take it away. Awesome, well thank you so much Infirmos for coming into this shop, um, inviting me to just your space and what you're creating for the world here and I would love to just join in you on your journey as well. So what's up everyone, my name is Michelle. I am the local business owner for Vibe the Healthy Spot. And what just transpired one day was I just woke up and I was just so sick and tired. I'm feeling sick and tired, I think. And I'm like, man, a lot of people probably go through this and just don't really open up about it. And so what it just inspired me was um, getting myself to the, to, the, to the best spot that I could mentally, physically, how I felt, how I looked, what I was eating. And then I was like, wow, I feel so great. People gotta know about this. Yes. People need to know about this because mental health is where everything starts from. Yeah, yeah, it's so true. And I mean, again, like with your story, and so many people can relate that when you're not feeling good, when you're not healthy, I mean, the two go hand in hand. Hand in hand. Right? Even with, if mentally, right? If you're depressed, if you're down, if you're anxious, it makes it harder to live that healthy lifestyle. Yes. So tell me more just about Bob the Healthy Spot. I mean, you know, I'm a fan. <laughs> Absolutely. So here you come in, you grab a great drink that's healthy for you. It has herbal tea, aloe vera, beach salt to get you going for the day, get that energy bursting, right? You see? She starts dancing with her drink a little bit. <laughs> Everything is mentally wired with energy. Yeah. So I feel like when you come in, you're feeling good. Even if you're not feeling good, you can learn how to feel good based upon energy. Yeah. And so here we provide not just nutritional shakes and teas here for the community, we, provi we provide energy, we provide motivation. Um, remember we interviewed one time previously, what is something that, what do you want people to grab from here? And I think for me it was just getting inspired yeah. um, in some type of way when they leave the shop. Like, wow, this is something that they grab that appears to them, yes. that they were able to leave the doors with feeling inspired. And so, by the healthy spot, when it was mental awareness month, this was a perfect topic. Yes. Um, like I said, everything starts mentally, and you mentally helped me get to the next level <laughs> of like, of this. So yes, It's awesome. crazy how it can go hand in hand. I I know. So do you have any questions for me? Yes, absolutely. Okay. okay. Uh -oh. I know. Uh-oh. I'm on the hot yes. seat, y'all. Yes. So as we know, it's mental health awareness. What does it mean for you? And maybe give me an example of how it has helped you personally as mm -hmm. well. Well, I'm so glad you asked that. So I have, I talk about it all the time. I'm a person who suffers with depression. And, you know, over the years, that's taken me very low from being suicidal to just not being able to function on jobs and things like that. So I have made it my passion to help bring awareness to mental health. Um, you know, I, was, I did an interview a few days ago and we talked about it, right? Mental health, a lot of times people think mental health is one way, like, mm. like depression, I should say. It's like, oh, you're crying all the time or you have no energy. That's certainly one form, but it can take so many different forms, right? Depression, right, anxiety, exactly. It can impact you so many different ways. Mm. So for me, my goal is to just help bring awareness yes. because I want people to know, especially women that's near and dear to me. <laughs> Women, I mean, and men, right? Yes, we yes, the men yes, yes. Their, their case as well. Yes. So, women, we applaud you guys. We're right there with you guys. Yes, yes. Hold each other's hands, hug them. Yes. Open up. It's the perfect time. It really is. And we need that. We need that sisterhood, that tribe, right? To know that no matter what traumatic events you've gone through, no matter how low you may have gotten, everything that can happen for us as women, you can still not just survive, but thrive. And that's really what I'm all about. My whole thing is honor, empower, and refresh. And so I create spaces and opportunities for women to be able to do that. So that is my natural me. That's me. Wow. <laughs> so sharing your, your, your journey 
with the world about what you went through and how you're able to come overcome that and now you're teaching other people how to overcome that yeah yeah and it's so amazing that other women can open up right because yeah. you're allowing them to trust you yeah. while they're opening up about what is it that we can help you with but you can't know if you don't open up That's but it. it starts with the trust you give them the opportunity of trust yes. for them to open up so you like i said man like you've inspired me <laughs> to open up and level up I and, love it. and you just never know who you might touch yeah and like you said it comes in so many different forms exactly and i firmly believe in transparency like sometimes you know i think especially my family kind of had to get used to it because it's like you're putting that out there you're putting out there that you're depressed or wow. you know you're putting out there things that you went through i was in a domestic violence relationship wow. for years and coming out of that the impact that that placed on me and and i talk about that i'm very open because i feel like my truth and my journey can help someone else because they see where i am now and people are like i would never believe that you would have been someone who was afraid to talk and you know sad and didn't know your value and your worth because they see now that i'm on the other side of it mm. so that's what i'm just super excited about just sharing that message any opportunity that i can yes and that's beautiful that you're opening up so much right now even yeah. a lot of women are going through what you went through current stage yeah. is there one thing that you can maybe give them a, a word of advice a phrase something to get them going maybe yeah yeah you know and i'm so glad you said that because it's so true i mean women are just having a hard time in a lot of ways right especially through the pandemic and relationships and all of that so i think the first thing that i would encourage all my girlfriends out there is you have to put you first. And I know that's easier said than done because most of us are not used to doing that. But the first step is loving you. Get with a coach, a good friend, a therapist, someone who can help you dig into who you are at your core. It is, yes, you are a mom, yes, you are a wife, girlfriend, whatever, but there's so much more to you yes. that you wanna tap Absolutely. into, right? And then when you Absolutely. realize that, girl, you can oh. do it. as you're unlocking that your fullest potential there's so many things that you didn't even know about or aware about yourself yes, yes. and you're like wow i did not even know that you know like, yes. you can do this and yes. you can do this exactly and um like you said people know you so when you're sharing your journey and you're sharing your journey with the people that know you they're more likely gonna see that thrive that you have. Yes. Because yes. they know you, they know where you've been from. Exactly. And now you're being your authentic self, you're being vulnerable for exactly. them to see that. And now they're trusting you. That's it. To get, you know what I mean? So That's I love it. how it flows so easily it with does. that. It does, it does. And you know what's amazing is when you're walking in your truth, right? Truth and gratitude, like this season of my life, truth and gratitude yes. is just huge. When you're doing that, you attract the people who are in that same space, like my good friend here. <laughs> Notice how you start to line up with people who are on the same mission, the same goals, and we all may have different businesses and things like that, but at the core, it's truth and gratitude that we really live by. And so it just is a beautiful thing. So I'm just here to say women, no matter where you are right now, no matter what season you are in, this is a beautiful space of transformation and you can do it. You you can reach your next goals. Absolutely. And wherever you are today is so perfect because just acknowledging yourself that this is the current state you're in, but you're not a tree, you guys. We can yes. let people, women know that we're not trees. We can move, we can change, yes. we can grow. Come on now. Yeah. Yes. All the way through <laughs> and doing it together, right? Yes. Because you don't see one tree just grow. You see many, many trees growing together. And so I love it. Um, we can do it together with women. I totally believe that. And I love your energy. You're Thank so you. Slow. <laughs> <laughs> yes, oh my goodness. Well, I think as we kind of wrap up today's segment, right? Yes. Because yep. we're going to be doing more of this. I love it. I think even past May, right? Let's, Let's keep do it. this going because we are two powerhouses that are ready to spread all of our love and joy to <laughs> you all. And we want to bring you in as well. So we will be meeting up more often and you will be seeing more of these little snippets from us, right? Absolutely. And I love that we can maybe invite a new guest, maybe yes. and we can do something. Yeah. Different perspective of yes. things, um, different upcomings and like you said, just inspiring women. If we open up now, we can get a whole a whole empire of women opening up and inspiring that next person, that next person. Now that we focus on you, how can you do that? 
I love it. I love it. Well, I'm excited. So follow by the healthy spots. <laughs> My Natural Me Woman and Week Isn't Useless, which is my new brand and product line encouraging people that no matter how low you feel right now, you may feel weak, whether from mental illness or challenges or even physical, but you are not useless. You just need support. So follow that and we'll, we'll be coming back for more. We'll be coming back and I think you'll be joining us soon. Yes. <laughs> awesome.